Uh, I gotta, I gotta admit something because it's Super Bowl week. Well, one, I want to tell a real fun story because I think I don't think too many people know. Yeah. Uh, I, I'm ready to retire the Super Bowl celebrations and anniversaries. I'm officially like sick and done with it. Like I know I was trying to get to the five year mark. I don't even want to celebrate five years. Uh, four years was enough of like remembering the Super Bowl and. Hey, do you remember uh, how great the NFC Championship game was? Because this is what happened on 30, 38 to 7. Yes, yes, uh, yes, I have. Yeah, we get it. Now we're trying to win a, win another Super Bowl. Hey, do you remember uh, when they won the Super Bowl? Yeah, that was that was great. And now it's like, hey, do you also remember Jason Kelsey's speech? Like four days later, there's all these anniversaries in February that goes on and on. And I'm, I'm tired of it. I'm tired of re-celebrating the Super Bowl already. Does that, does that make me a bad fan? No. <laughs> No, it doesn't. I'm so done with it. No, because it's everywhere. You know what I mean? You follow all these Eagles people, and so everybody's just like, oh, yeah, this is the time. Let's go. I got to get those likes and retweets. You know what I mean? So it's just you, you lay it on super thick all the time. And, yeah, I I get tired of it. This is the first time, as you've talked about, I was like, am I going to mute the word Super Bowl? Am I, think I, gonna, I am. Am I going to do that? Like, I, I don't know if I have the heart to actually do it. Just but... mute Philly special. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that too. That too. Like, I know it was... And it was. It's one of the greatest plays ever called in a Super Bowl, especially when you put situation in context with it. Mm-hmm. I don't care anymore. Like, I need I need time to appreciate. Just like Tom Brady, I need time, I will a never. way to appreciate everything that everyone's done. There are three, four people left, five people left on this roster that are still part of that team. Like, I, I just, I get it. It means something to everybody else. Uh, our good friend got married in the street from the Super Bowl, so I get it. Yep. But, like, I don't know. T, I'm, it's, it's, I, I'm done. I'm it, done celebrating the Super Bowl. It's like whatever Drake song was really popular at the time. You're like, you've been playing it since 2018. <laughs> yeah. It's like, I we like I get it. Yeah. And like, if how I many hear, times and, do I have to hear this? And that's the thing, right? Like, the Super Bowl never went away since they won. It's never gone away. Yeah. So it, it's just when you live in it five years and every two years like, oh, by the way, and that happened when the Eagles won the Super Bowl, 41 to 33. <laughs> like, it just At some point, it's like, yeah, well, I get that, but I've been hearing it every day for four years now. Yeah. I just, at some point, it doesn't sound the same. This you is know? what Malcolm Jenkins tried to do when he tried to rip down the Super Bowl banner in 2018 and just make, we're not doing it this time. We need to go win another. We're still there. Everybody is still there in the clouds because we want to feel happy and not think about Jonathan Gannon or Nick Sirianni or Jalen Hurts can't throw football. Right. Or, like they just want to be in this little stupid box with all these fun memories. And I get it. Like, just don't keep saying it on social media. Like, I'm so done with it. It's because we're so used to being losers. Like I said a couple months ago, everybody still talks about the uh, Sixers Toronto series. Always. Yeah. Oh, that just no. goes in. No. 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 They probably lose in double overtime. Or whatever it is. I don't I don't know. Like too many too many what ifs and then reminiscing in this case. Yeah. Like, yeah. And if I hear hold up, wait a minute, you thought I was finished. I'm done with that too. You ban Meek Mill? I'm not banning Meek Mill, I'm banning that song. Yeah, dreams and nightmares. <laughs> No more dreams and nightmares either. Like it was all a that great... song's like eight years old too. By yes. the way, so it was old when we were using it as an anthem. <laughs> it was on the last like last year you could use that song. It just it it you know yeah I'm done with it. Yeah. And if that makes me a bad Eagles fan, so be it. Enjoy it however you want to. But I want to be the Rams and the Bengals. I'm I don't want to be the 2017 Eagles because. That guy's down in Jacksonville, and he's going to get fired real soon because do you see who he's hiring? Doug is, by the way, just real quick note, Doug Peterson is being Doug Peterson. Fucking Mike McCoy is your quarterback oh, coach. God. A quarterback killer or some reason, like, everyone forgets that, and then, like, oh, what a great hire. Fantastic. He's just putting the good old boys network down there. 